What's up guys, it's Cameron here, back with another video. If you're new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below and turn those post notifications on so that you don't miss an upload. So guys, I feel like I've said this in every single one of my videos recently, but my voice is gone. It's like the second I get it back, I lose it again. I just feel like my allergies have been so bad and then I'm also going out and I'm screaming and it's just like a mix of everything. So my voice just keeps going away. I look so freaking greasy right now because I'm like honestly kind of sweating, but welcome back to a day in my life. I'm going to try to make it one day today because I maybe I'll vlog until tomorrow I don't know I'm getting my wisdom teeth out on Thursday today's Tuesday um I think the day is like July 6th yeah happy July thank you guys so much for 17k subscribers I actually saw it last night really late and I'm just so happy um hopefully I'll have 20k by the end of July but I appreciate you guys so so much and I'm sorry if I've been kind of MIA I'm really trying to get back on track with my posting and my editing and just like not having videos up so long after they're filmed because that becomes confusing for you guys probably like wait this is from a few weeks ago this makes no sense you know anyway Anyways, I did my whole morning routine as you guys saw besides making breakfast and I'm starving So let's go downstairs make some breakfast get some water get some tea because I need to soothe this voice Okay, first I want some water. This is kind of full, but I want to add ice and more water Got it Yum. All right, even though it's hot in my house, I need tea because Okay, I don't know what I'm gonna make for breakfast, so I need to just look through my fridge and figure it out because we haven't gone grocery shopping. I'm gonna need two egg waffles. Because I really don't want eggs. That's the only other thing I can think of. Okay, I have my breakfast, my tea, my water. We're all set. Not the healthiest breakfast, but I really don't have much, so this is what we're working with. Okay. My tea. Eat. Okay, I just took my vitamins. These days I'm taking the women's multivitamins from Vitafusion. I take two of these every morning. They have like a lot of different vitamins in them. And then I take these airborne um, immune support elderberry vitamins. I take two of those. Then I take one probiotic. These are the Garden of Life ones. I do really like these ones because they have 40 billion CFU and 16 different probiotic strains, which is really good. And you're supposed to only take one capsule daily, which I think is good because, you know, it like saves more. I hate the ones where you have to take two. And then I take these JS Health Hair and Energy vitamins. I actually worked with JS Health. I do have a coupon code for them i could put it on the screen if you guys want to get some money off your order these actually are really good they make my hair very healthy and i feel like they do give me a lot of energy and they also have stress and anxiety ones that also work really well so yeah and i also just put some of my flonase love my flonase if you know you know okay guys so it's currently 1209 i actually just had therapy from 11 to 11 45 it was honestly a really good session i honestly needed that so i'm happy with that and now i'm just editing my week in my life video from like over two weeks ago i want to try to edit it and try to upload it today but it might not get done till tomorrow i don't really know um so i'm working on editing that now i'm almost done editing it and yeah so i made a to-do list too i will read you guys what's on my to-do list i just been using this little one from amazon i'm just trying to finish up the last few pages on it because it is almost done and yeah i always switch up like what i use and i also was planning out some stuff in my calendar i don't plan out content in this calendar i actually plan it on google calendar but i was more so planning out like my life type of stuff so let me read my to-do list to you guys okay so on my to-do list for today um for the must get done today so the top three i put edit and upload my week in my life video number two is i have to contact youtube because I got a strike. No, I didn't actually get a strike. They said I didn't get a strike, but they pretty much took my pomegranate shower routine and made it only for 18 and up, and I don't get monetized from it, which makes no sense. Um, there's no nudity in it. I'm literally wearing a bathing suit. So if someone's like reporting it, bye. I really don't like you, but you know, I don't know. Number three is I have to edit and send a TikTok to a brand. So I'm gonna do that after I finish this. And then on my regular to-do list, I have to go to CVS, which I actually need to call them again because they didn't answer last time. I wanna film my cucumber and green tea shower routine, film a self care routine tiktok later um i have to upload this tiktok for a brand and then i want to cleanse my crystals finally the ones that i got in colorado i still haven't cleansed them and then i have to edit two videos like or start editing them and then for my appointments at 11 was therapy and then i want to go to the gym i put 12 30 but it's probably not gonna be till one because it's 12 10 right now um so i'm gonna actually call cvs right now because i need to get my prescription a cvs pharmacy if you are calling about the COVID-19 vaccine or testing, please press 1. Can I speak to a pharmacist? Okay, the pharmacy. Which would you like? Say, refill a prescription. Enter the 6 to 7. Sorry. 
can I can I speak to a pharmacist hey guys updates it is 3 50 and I'm still in the same spot like I have not gone to the gym I honestly just got so caught up in my work like I finished editing my week in my life right now it's currently uploading it's doing its processing but I literally have just been so caught up editing and like just doing a ton of work that I was like I want to finish the work and then go to the gym I ate kava my leftover kava that I had from last night and I finished editing the video and I'm just trying to get it uploaded once it's uploaded I'm gonna head off to the gym like I really need to go but yeah I'm happy that I got the work done though i don't even like i still have all this time to go to the gym it's 3 40 3 50 so but what else what else was i also finished the tiktok that i had to send a brand so i'm like really just on track with everything right now i'm getting myself back together i'm gonna finish editing a summer clothing haul tonight upload that tomorrow then i'm gonna start editing my car organization video to have up by the end of the week and then my week in my life from not last week but the week before um and i'm gonna try to have all these videos pre-edited to go up while i'm like recovering from wisdom teeth and then probably by like the second day of my wisdom teeth i'll be able to start like editing again and like doing stuff in bed and that'll be me catching up on other content but tomorrow i have a lot of content to film so today was editing day tomorrow's gonna be more filming day i did want to film a shower routine today i may still do it when i get back but it kind of just depends gonna finish sorry i'm having trouble hearing you i guess i accidentally pressed the button um but yeah i'm gonna finish this and then i'll talk to you guys before i go to the gym this is the only spot that i can have my phone up against something and you guys can see me so i'm gonna have to deal with my steering wheel on the way but i just got to the gym while I'm outside the gym. I'm gonna take my pre-workout. I use the Alani new pre-workout. This is the Galaxy Limited one. I actually really like it. Um, it works really well and it tastes good. I don't know where the scooper is, so I hate when the scooper gets lost. And the Anyways, so I haven't gone to the gym in like a week and a half because my vacation, but I was really consistent right before my vacation. So I'm trying to get back into it for literally two days because I'm getting my wisdom teeth out. But right when I'm recovered from my wisdom teeth, I'll be back. I just need to sit first. For some reason, most of it just got stuck. <laughs> Sometimes it all doesn't come out. Like, it'll just get stuck in there, so I have to do it again. That was a clump. It really clumped together. Sometimes when it clumps together, it makes it easier, not gonna lie. But yeah, I'm about to go in. I think I'm gonna do cardio and legs today. Probably a little bit of abs. It's freaking hot out, but this is my first time going outside today, and it's already 5 o'clock. So, I'll talk to you guys when I get in there. Sorry, there's like a weird reflection. It's raining and the rain from my windshield is like putting a weird reflection on my face. But I actually just finished at the gym. Um, I had a really good workout. Um, pretty much what I did was I did some cardio. So what I've been doing is I've been going on the treadmill. I walk on incline at a speed of 3.5, an incline of 10 for five minutes. And then I'll run a mile at six um, on zero incline. It takes me 10 minutes to run a mile at the speed of like six. So um, that's what I do. And then I'll usually walk on an incline for another five to 10 minutes at the same speed as before um so that's what i've been doing and then it like makes me sweat a lot but today i decided because i was like i have like a little bit of like congestion and um i also didn't want to like push myself too hard pretty much i did the walk on incline for five minutes i ran for five minutes at speed of six and then i walked on incline pretty pretty much for the rest of the time um up until i got to 30 minutes so i kind of was like going up and down with the speeds and the inclines and stuff but pretty much after i did that it's like thunder and lightning so bad outside after i did that i went upstairs where like the big floor is with the turf and i did a little lower body workout it was like not a lot but it, i definitely felt it i did a dumbbell squat with one dumbbell at 25 pounds i'm trying to start doing lighter weight with more reps just because i want to do more like high intensity sweating and like not taking as long of breaks and when i go higher weights i have to take longer breaks so 25 pounds dumbbell 15 squats and then 20 jumping jacks and then i would take a 30 second break and i did that four times and then my next workout was single leg rdl with a dumbbell i used 15 pound dumbbells and that's pretty much all i did for legs and then for abs i used an eight pound medicine ball with the handle i did like the little like i call them the little teapot things because it looks like you're doing like i'm a little teapot or whatever but they're really called like side crunches i think or i don't even know what they're called it's where you like hold something down here and then you like bend um so i did 15 of those on both sides then i did 15 
Russian twists and then 15 v-ups all with the weights and I did that four times and then I stretched so it was definitely a good workout um, but I want to get home probably eat something I think my mom got Chinese food I'm gonna eat some chicken and broccoli and it's also just bad weather right now so I really do want to get home I also need to shower because I low-key feel like I don't smell too well right now and you guys know me I always want to smell good but anyway it's gonna go home um there's literally been a person in front of me this whole time I've been vlogging but I don't think they can see me because of the rain on my windshield so I'm gonna go home now. Hey guys, so I'm home from the gym. I just ate some dinner, had some Chinese food. I always forget to tell you guys what I'm eating because I just like to eat when it's right in front of me. I forget to record sometimes, but I'm currently have a cough drop in my mouth, if you guys noticed. Bro, is it just me or when you use stick chapsticks? Does this ever happen to yours? Because I always tend to use the side, like it's lipstick. This just happens to some of them. This one, it's not like that, but I've also barely used this one. Anyways, that's not important. You guys do not care. I want to take a shower. I was going to wash my hair tonight, but I think I'm going to wait till tomorrow because since tomorrow will probably be my last day working out for a while because of the wisdom teeth, I just want to like wash my hair tomorrow after my workout. So yeah, I don't like how this glares right there. So I'm going to move you guys over here. What scent do I want to use? Because I really just kind of want to have like a little self-care night. I might make a TikTok of it. I don't really know yet Um, because I'm kind of just like debating. i got to take my hair out of this bun and put it in like a loose bun. Somebody commented on one of my videos that my hairline, they were concerned about my hairline because I wear my hair in too tight of buns. And like just to tell you guys, I do not wear my hair in a bun every single day. But when I work out, I am going to wear it in a bun. And then in a lot of my videos, it seems like I wear it in a bun because what I'll do is, is I'll film like four videos in one day and I'll do my hair in a bun because a lot of times this is what my hair looks like it's just not cute like my natural hair is nice the first day after the first day horrible I'll put in a bun and I like like to do a nice slick back bun so it looks like put together like either low or high and that's like my cute hair socks I don't like to put heat on my hair usually I don't have the bun in for that long like it's like for that day when I'm filming and I take it out and it just seems like I have it in a lot of videos because I film multiple videos in one day but for those of you who are concerned my hairline is Fine. I have a big forehead regardless, but my hairline's not receding, so we don't have to worry about my for my freaking hairline. One thing about my hairline though is I did get sunburn on my hairline and it was peeling the other day, but it's kind of doing better now, so that's good. But yeah. I really don't know what scent I want to use. Let me figure this out. Okay, I'm actually flossing right now, but I picked out my scent. I'm gonna use Bonfire Bash. I have the shower gel and the lotion. And I think I'm gonna use a scrub. I'm gonna use a Tahitian vanilla bean scrub from Tree Hut. And I'm gonna make a shower talk because I haven't made one in so long. Also earlier, you guys, I didn't show you my scent of the day this morning, but I used um, my coconut secret deodorant. And not that it really matters. That's not the exciting part. Coconut from Bath and Body Works. I don't know what just fell. And then coconut palm from Mix Bar. I have pre-workout my system right now, so that's why I'm a little like all over the place right now. But anyways, I'm gonna go shower. Hey guys, so currently 11, 10 at night and I had different plans for this night. I wanted to do like a self-care night and just didn't go as planned. I am just not really feeling my best right now. I just am like super overwhelmed. It's kind of that time of the month, so I know I'm feeling this way, but I'm overwhelmed. I just feel very like stressed, annoyed about a lot of things. I'm emotional. I'm in pain. Like literally my wisdom teeth hurt so bad. Like I'm so ready to get them out, but I'm also so scared. And I just want to cry, but I'm not gonna. I'm gonna empty my laundry though because my mom's getting mad because she needs baskets and all my laundry is still in the laundry baskets. So I'm gonna put it all away and then probably just go to sleep and vlog tomorrow. I told myself after the gym that I wasn't gonna spend another night sitting on my phone all night on TikTok and that I was gonna like actually do something like a self-care night or edit or watch a movie or something besides sitting on tiktok and i just sit on tiktok and i like literally can't stop myself like i just don't understand why i'm like this it's like let me know if you can relate like sometimes do you wish like it's not even like i need to do anything crazy like literally just watch a movie rather than sit on freaking tiktok and i can't get myself to do it and it just sucks but yeah that's kind of where i'm at so i'm just trying to get myself together i just feel stressed because i'm getting my wisdom teeth out in two days and i just feel like i'm not gonna be able to do as much stuff and i'm just all over the place but but anyways, I'm gonna finish putting this laundry away and then go to sleep or something or I don't even know. Good morning, beautiful people. I need to learn how to put this umbrella up because I don't even know what I'm doing. Oh, here. Not gonna lie, it sounds like I'm breaking it, so I'm gonna have to ask my mom for help. I'm sweating right now. I wanted to have a nice relaxing morning sit outside, do work, eat some breakfast out there. But the umbrella is not going up. Me and my mom both couldn't get it and I literally cannot sit out there without the umbrella. It's so hot out, like it has to be like 90 degrees. 
Um, has a woman come in and clean her house every two weeks, so she's up there vacuuming. But I'm gonna eat my breakfast, the usual. This is the unsweetened yogurt from Silk, and I don't really like it at all. It's so bland, obviously. So I added honey and then mixed it in. So it's like a natural sweetener. But I forgot to take a TikTok. I'm gonna write my five minute journal. I forgot to write the night portion last night, so I'm gonna write that and then write today's. By the way, it's the next day, in case you didn't realize that already. One day away from my wisdom teeth appointment and I'm freaking out, but. All right, I need to make a to-do list for today. I didn't really get everything done on my to-do list yesterday, but the good thing is, is that I got all my top threes done. So I'm gonna make today's to-do list now. And like I said, I'm using up the rest of the pages in this. I'm trying to be more productive and just like get my life together because I've been a mess. So today is the 7th of July. Bro, is my wisdom teeth. I will be vlogging my wisdom teeth. I don't know if I said that yet, but they honestly hurt so bad. Like, I'm so ready to get them out. It's like insane. Must get done today. The first thing is finish editing summer clothing haul. I was gonna film a shower routine today because I didn't film it yesterday, but I don't know if I'm gonna do it. Me trying to make myself less nervous for my wisdom teeth is writing down that I'm grateful for getting them out tomorrow because they've been hurting so bad. So I've been writing in my journal and on my to-do list because there's a section I asked you what you're grateful for. I put getting my wisdom teeth out tomorrow. And as scared as I am, I'm still grateful that I'm getting them out because I'm tired of having them because they hurt. I definitely did not finish my breakfast because the strawberries are low-key mushy. But I need to eat a lot of food today because I have to stop eating at 12 and my appointment is until 12 a.m. My appointment is until 11 a.m. tomorrow. I'm always hungry when I wake up, so. So, I have to do some computer work, so I'm gonna do that right now. Don't really know what time I'm gonna go to the gym. Probably will aim for 12, maybe 11.30. I'll just see how long this takes me. I have a lot to do after, so I'm gonna do some work. Okay guys, I finally finished editing my summer clothing haul and I just uploaded it. I had done an Instagram poll to decide between two different thumbnails because I literally couldn't decide. It was, I'll show you guys, like this. And it got majority bottom for the bottom one. So I did the bottom one as a thumbnail and I like it. I think it's cute. I honestly just didn't know which one I wanted to do. I didn't know if I wanted to show a preview of the outfits or just me holding the outfits. I don't really know. Anyways, it's currently 1.15. I always end up later than I say it's gonna. I underestimate my time so much like how long it takes me to edit and finish stuff sorry that it's a little dark right now but i'm actually hungry so i think i'm gonna go make lunch and then probably go to the gym around two so that's what i'm gonna do i'll probably do like an hour and a half workout come back here and i'll start filming at like four i have to film a get ready with me video and a summer favorites video which i have to make a list of my summer favorites and then i have to film an inclusion for this company so i think i'll be able to get everything done before it gets dark i'm gonna talk to you guys in a little bit I'm gonna go make some lunch i actually will probably show you guys what i'm gonna make because i always forget to show you guys my meals i need to make sure that i'm eating pretty heavy meals today because um like i said i have to stop eating at 12 and i can't eat and then after tomorrow it's gonna be really hard for me to eat filling meals so that's the plan let's go downstairs though okay i ended up not bringing my camera down because the lady who was cleaning my house um was down there but i just had two slices of pizza because we had leftover pizza from a few days ago not the healthiest but like i said i'm just trying to eat really filling foods today because the lighting is like so bad right now so i have to just digest for a little bit not only did i just eat but i just ate two slices of pizza so i'm a little bit full i just want to let my food digest drink some water that's what i'm gonna do probably we'll watch some youtube my ac is blasting so you're not gonna hear me we're just gonna do this pre-workout and go in the gym It's so hot. Oh my god, I need to open the window. Jeez. Skin is sweating, but it's still glowing. My skin has been so good lately. Whew, good workout. Time to go home and take a shower. Hello, beautiful people. I'm back from the gym. Workout was really good. I'm trying to stay super hydrated because of what I told you a thousand times. I'm gonna just show you guys the scent that I'm about to use in the shower. I do have to film a get ready with me video. I'm gonna do a Q and A, and it's gonna be a brand deal too. So I'm gonna get in the shower right now. So I'm gonna use for my body wash the Caress Black Orchid and Patchouli Oil. I'll probably use my Dove antibacterial body wash first because I want to use some of that up, and I also feel disgusting after the gym. Um, and I'm gonna actually pair this with the Dark Kiss from Bath and Body Works. Um, the lotion and the fragrance. I don't have the body wash or the shower gel in this. They smell not similar, but they pair well together. Honestly, I only tried it out because. 
because I thought the packaging was really similar. I thought maybe they'll go well. And not that they smell the same. This is a little bit more of like a perfumey smell. Well, this just smells like a little florally, I feel like. And it's very light and subtle while this is like a much stronger smell. But I feel like the two go together very well. And I might use a scrub. I don't know which one yet. I have to look in the bathroom. But I'll show you guys whatever I end up using. But I'm about to go take a shower now. I gotta get moving. I think I'm gonna wash my... Well, I'm gonna wash my hair actually. So I'm gonna take this bun out of my hair. And I'm going to have my sister braid my hair tomorrow because a lot of my friends have told me that when they get the risen teeth out they feel freaking ugly obviously you have gauze and blood coming out of your mouth so i want to like feel a little bit better about myself because knowing me i'll probably cry about how ugly i look and people have told me that that's happened to them so i'm gonna have my sister braid my hair before i get them out tomorrow but yeah so I'm just gonna brush my hair out and go and take a shower. I always brush my hair before I wash it because I don't like to brush it in the shower anymore. I'll sometimes brush it after, but I try to brush it before mostly, um, just cause like it's not good to brush it while it's wet, so. All right, um, I think I'm gonna use a hair mask and I think I'm gonna use a scalp scrub, so I'm gonna go in there right now. Okay guys, I just got out of the shower and I'm gonna do my skincare routine. I'm actually going to be using my Your Skincare products. I still have been using them since the video. If you guys did not see my video of me reviewing my personalized skincare, routine from your skincare make sure to go check that out on my channel i'll have it like in the little thing above i have still been using those products because they really have helped my skin tremendously and that's how you guys know that i wasn't just saying all that because it's sponsored because i have been using these for so long and i'm still continuing to use them um, but i'm also using a new skincare product today with that and that is the foreo luna 3 this is a facial cleansing brush it's actually electric it's like a sonic facial cleansing brush and it has a button and pretty much it has a timer on it for a minute and pretty much you're supposed to wash your face for about a minute it and not many people you know actually time it I know I don't actually time it I just kind of do it for how long I think is right but this actually has a timer on it so it'll actually go for a minute so when you hold down the button it just vibrates and you just basically would move it all around your skin and it'll stop after a minute if you want to turn it off you can just hold the button down sometimes a little bit difficult to turn off but pretty much the way it works is it is Bluetooth so you're supposed to set it up through an app on your phone so I actually just started using it yesterday and I actually really like it so far of course I haven't really seen any like results so far but as for cleansing, I feel like it really does clean my skin very, very well. And it just feels really nice on the skin. And it also is just like nice to have something to cleanse your face for you. And my favorite part about it is the timer. This video isn't sponsored, by the way. They did send me the product, but I'm not required to say any of this. This is genuinely my honest opinion and impression on it. I wouldn't say first impression because I have used it before. But um, third impression because it's like my third time using it. But pretty much I have the Freo app on my phone. And I just connected the device through the app. It usually has a serial number on it. But this one I was able to just connect connect through the Bluetooth so it was a lot easier I didn't need to put the serial number in and there's different things you can do on the apps so, like you can control it on the app do like different settings on the app but I personally will keep it simple there's like different intensities through the app so if I wanted to turn the intensity up or down I think it can go up to like 16 and I had it on 8 it was like perfect for me I think so you can adjust those kind of things on the app you can also go to start cleansing and you can just like adjust the time and stuff I of course have it on a minute which makes the most sense but if you wanted to do it longer, I guess you can. Oh, okay, so this basically times it so different areas of your face. So it's like a second on one area, a second on another. And it's telling you what area of your face that you should be on, I'm pretty sure. Um, I don't really use that, though. I pretty much just press the button, turn it on, and kind of go. Um, I haven't really played around with the app too, too much. But it is pretty cool that you have it connected through an app. I have the one for sensitive skin, which is the purple one. I got this one because I don't like to use anything too harsh on my face. Because I do have a little bit of sensitive skin on my face. So I'm using this today with my Your Skin Care Foaming Cleanser. Um, and I'm just gonna put a little bit of the cleanser. I put two to three pumps on here. My face is already a little wet from the shower, but I'm gonna put some more water on my face. And I really do like using this after the gym because I feel like my face gets like super gross after the gym. Okay, now it doesn't wanna work. I think I pressed something, so hold on. Okay, there we go. <laughs> so I'm getting it all in my towel, but pretty much as you guys can tell, I'm just moving the product around and I'm just focusing on, oh, I kinda got it on my eye a little bit. I'm just focusing on one area of my face at a time. I think it does like a double buzz when it's telling you to switch areas of your face but I kind of just go with it and just do as I please for a minute um and it just feels nice on my face and I make sure to like get on my neck and just kind of all over my nose and it just feels like you know you're at a spa and you're getting a little facial massage so I, I kind of like it and I feel like it just like really cleans my skin because sometimes I feel like my hand just doesn't do enough especially after the gym like I just feel like my face can never be too clean I actually wanted one of these for a while so them sending me one was really good okay so towards the end you're gonna hear it feel like three vibrates and that's how you know it's ending so so then it stops. Um, so I'm just gonna rinse my face. Okay. And my face just feels 
so clean. I'm just gonna use the rest of my skincare products. Again, if you wanna see my review on the Your Skincare brand, make sure to go check out that video. So if you wanna get your own Freya Luna 3 or any of the Freya products, I will have a link in the description for you guys to go and shop on Freya's website. I need to go and film. I wanna make a smoothie. I wanna get my life together. So let's get going because it's already 5.15 p.m. Hey guys, so long time no talk. Pretty much after I last spoke to you, I think it was after the gym, I pretty much filmed my Girl Talk Get Ready With Me video. Then I filmed an inclusion for a brand and then I filmed my hygiene summer favorites, um, which is gonna be a collaboration video with somebody else on YouTube, which I'm super excited about. But I have a mess in my room because I never cleaned up my makeup. I just cleaned up the products from the hygiene summer favorites video or whatever, summer hygiene favorites. But like I said, makeup is all over, so I'll show you guys. Just a little bit of a mess over there. Um, my eyes are having all sorts of issues right now, so I put so much eye cream on by mistake and then I also have a lash serum on and then I also like literally like rubbed my eyes so much to get the lash glue off of them I'm nervous my wisdom teeth guys. It is like 1140. So I'm almost supposed to stop drinking water I already ate I ate like two dinners just in case I ate a burger at like seven and then I ate another burger at like ten So I just want to drink like all my water in my room. I'm gonna finish it only can drink water for like 10 more minutes So, um, I don't want to go to sleep too late So i'm gonna try to clean my room and then probably sit in bed and just like go on my computer for a little bit But I think i'm gonna close up the video here just because there's nothing else for me to show you guys I will be vlogging and me getting my wisdom teeth out tomorrow. So that should be fun But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video I hope that you all enjoyed it If you did like it make sure to go ahead and give it a big thumbs up comment down below hit that subscribe button And i'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys